first, real quick, but just who killed Jenny? We can't. No. <laughs> oh, did you want to play coy? Seriously? Before we start the video, I have to give a big thank you to Showtime for not only sponsoring this video, but allowing me to meet the cast of the new L Word Generation Q. I'm so excited, so let's get in there and meet everybody. What's up, you guys? It's your girl, Amber, and today I have a very special day for you. We're interviewing the new cast of The L Word, Generation Q. Woo! And yes. I'm here with two of my favorites because I got to hang out with them last night, and they're so lit, so sweet, so we're, let's get into it. Okay, yeah, we're let's really do excited it. For this. So right now, I am sitting with Kate and Leisha. Hello. Shane and Alice, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so how are you guys? We're doing great. Good. Are you guys excited about this new season? Yeah. Yes. And I am here with Leo and Roseanne. <laughs> how are you guys? Good. Doing well, how about you? Yeah. I'm good. Tell us about your characters. Micah, um, aside from him being an adjunct professor of social work, uh, lives with Danny and Sophie, played by Ari and Roseanne. I play uh, a character named Sarah Finley. Uh, she's awesome. She's sort of like a... I like to say golden box. She's a fun box. <laughs> a lot of wild card energy. Yeah. Out of Sarah Finley. It's, it's you know it's a whole new cast except for Kate and Jennifer and myself. They're awesome, great new characters. Um, they shoot in LA. Sexy. It's fun. I don't know. It's yeah. back. His storyline really is about uh, finding vulnerability in his life. He doesn't have a great history with dating, so we get to see him experience dating. She um, works on Alice's show, and she's best friends with with these. my. Yeah. I'm a PR executive for my father's company. We're like the polar opposites. Yeah. I think Danny is just the total opposite of a wild card and just like a fun box, which I totally wish I could be. I mean, you having a show was like, duh. Like, it that made was sense, the most perfect right? thing ever, yeah. And we're excited to see what's going on with you, Shane. Mm -hmm. I mean, the new house is the bomb. Oh, I like, like, oh my God, I want yeah. to come over and kick it. I'm yeah, jealous it's a good of house. family right now. Yeah. It's a good house, I have to say. I was actually <laughs> quite impressed with what Shane had done with her life in the last 10 years. I play Sophie Suarez. She is a producer on The Alice Show. Their goal is to create content and, uh, about queer life that is relatable and that people need to see on TV. I know a lot of the old stuff was in Palm Springs, yeah? No, all of it was Vancouver. in Vancouver. Really? Canada, mm -hmm. yeah. Wait, I thought it was in Palm Springs, no? Never. No, wow. we did. You know, watching them when I was younger and then growing up and being a YouTuber and, and becoming an activist in the space where now I'm like hosting or doing things with people that I'm like, oh, you're part of the reason why I'm out or do whatever, it's crazy. But for you yeah. guys, you're acting next to them. Like, are you okay? Like, how is it? Are you okay? Real, okay? Yeah. Like, I resonated with your two characters because I feel like I'm a mix of both. And you are a lot of my friends here in LA. Like your character. I think I told you yeah. this last night, mm -hmm. but yeah. like you're gonna resonate with a, a lot of people, like especially a lot of my friends that are coming to LA to make their dreams come true. I'm kind of going with it because I feel yeah. like as soon as I sit down and let it hit, I'm gonna be like, what am I doing here? Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's gonna be it's a weird. whole nother wave too for you guys when everybody starts seeing the episodes, finding you guys online and stuff, it's gonna be insane. I'm so excited for you guys. Watching it like live on Showtime, I think it's really gonna hit because yeah. it's like, it's such an overwhelming feeling for a show that meant so much yeah. to me, yeah. to and, us. And something that you said before that, that like now there's gonna be a younger generation watching this and it's gonna be like the same effect, but now we're the generation having an effect on these younger people. Right. And that's just too much to handle right now. We grew up to you guys. Like, you guys are our family members that you don't know that you're in our family. That's it's, amazing. I yeah. love that. I've never I, heard it like that before, but no, I love literally. that. Back to what we were talking about. Like, if you guys didn't watch it when it was on TV, and I watched towards the end because I, I was really young too, and I was in high school, mm -hmm. and I was like really scared to watch it, so I kept like turning it off every time my sister would come in. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times I would hit the wrong button, so just the TV went, I went off on accident, <laughs> and she's just like, so you're just sitting in silence? <laughs> yeah. If I was on a channel, I would always have like a, uh, you know, like previous channel to go back to that was yeah, like yeah. super just the PG. one button to just like yeah. so like if there was like a you know a naughty scene like yeah, that's right yeah. like, like, previous channel would be like cartoons they'd be like like why are you watching cartoons yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you know just some wholesome TV watching yeah <laughs> I think I was watching it one time and I think my dad came into the room or something and it happened to be like a more risque scene and I was just. I didn't even Stop. know what to do with it. The remote oh was God. far away. Oh my dad was there last night, oh my and God. we open up the season. There's some risque scenes, so how was that full well, circle yeah. right there for you? So that was, uh, so I said, I, as <laughs> soon as like the credits started going, I was like, Dad, please shut your eyes. <laughs> Just oh yeah. Close your eyes. Oh, that's good. And he like made his way into his suit jacket. <laughs> the show opened up the right way. <laughs> oh. If it didn't open like that, I think we would all be like, 
Hey. Yeah. 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 I told Ari in the other room too. It was the the bloody fingers was a a thing. Like we all needed that. Like how many yeah. times do you see that on TV? Icing on the cake. Because it's real life. No, it, it's never talked about, right? Yeah. Ever. It's real life. First, real quick, I've done a video about this. I've had the internet and an uproar. I don't know. You guys might have been tagged from it, but just who killed Jenny? Just. Uh. Well. Oh, we don't. We don't. We can't say. Okay. But. We can't. No. Because <laughs> we don't know. We don't know. Oh, so. Oh, did you want to play coy? No. Seriously? I don't. Yes, that was. was like the last thing I saw. I thought it was house. Nikki because I mean, uh, I mean, it's self suspicious. Thinking, she came too, out of the actually. bushes saying she was yeah. just coming to say hi, but like, yeah, like I think what? that made it too obvious that it wasn't her for me. Hmm. I am pleading the fifth. Wow. Yeah. On this, you'll get your answer. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I what can't you're, with oh you. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. We just have theories on the internet. What are your what theories? Are, what are they? Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, everybody kept saying the handrail is loose. Mm -hmm. So I just feel like she went up there, probably leaned back, and just fell to her death. But I always just thought it was interesting that if memory serves, wouldn't we hear a splash? Did we ever hear a splash? I don't remember. No? And uh, No, I guess we did hear a splash. I don't My remember. mind is, don't do this to me, okay? This no, has been a lot of years like, of listen, investigation. Alicia, listen. Alicia and Kate did an interview on TV Guide, and in the comments, someone uh, said that we're going to find out that Tina's going to be in jail for killing Jenny, and I thought that was, like, the most interesting comment. Wow. The person you least expect, maybe. I cannot confirm or deny that statement. Oh, my God. I think those are wonderful <laughs> theories, though. Those are <laughs> yeah, great. I love this. And there are a lot of questions that are answered. Oh, really? Mm hmm mm. You probably I promise. Okay. We wouldn't leave people hanging like Okay, that. thank God. We're not okay. I know you guys don't know me, but if I was on the show, what do you think my storyline would be? I think you'd fall, fall in somewhere. Well, I well, think you would date one of us. <laughs> yeah. Me. You'd date you me. You would date? Probably. Jack and Ari already decided that I should probably date Jack. You know what I'm oh, saying? Oh, okay. Wow. Okay. But I slipped in maybe bet, you know? Like, yeah, or, yeah. Oh, you sure, like, sure. like bet, okay. Alice yeah. is taken, so, um, <laughs> yeah. Let's write this in. I, I got you. All right, no cool. <laughs> oh, I got a whisper in somebody's <laughs> ear. What am I going to do for a living? You're going to be a, like, music producer. Oh, that's lit. I can see yeah. that. You'd, you'd work uh, at Alice's place. I could maybe, Ooh, like, um... I think maybe you... you come over and try to take Sophie's job. I think you would be a really cool teacher at Angie's school. Oh. Wow. And she'd like look up to you and then you'd, you'd meet Bet. Oh, look at you. Right? And then what would happen with Bet? Well, I think you would, she would be very invested in you because she probably really like loves you you as a teacher and, mm -hmm. and think you've invested a lot of time in Angie and you maybe you guys get really, um, you get to know each other really well. Mm. I think that's good, right? It's really good. Really oh, you know what? You could date Tess. Bet. <laughs> Bet is what everybody should be saying. Bet. What's her name? Who having sex with? You didn't say that. Oh, Get some juicy Finley. stuff. Yo, why, why not Finley? Why did Jack say that too? Jack <gasps> volunteered or so. Ooh, I'm gonna throw it out there. I'm gonna say Danny. Yo, why Ooh. did they both say that? That's I'm crazy. Say Danny. I'm coming in and just Danny. messing. I'm taking your job and your girl. I mean, it, hey, give me something to fight for. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just let me like, have it. Let me the, give me an obstacle. <laughs> oh <laughs> my God. It's Actually, true. my my idea for you, I still can't give away why. Can it's you whisper a, it in my ear really quick? Oh, that's so good. Oh, and I come can't on. tell you. That beats mine. Okay, I'm gonna ask you guys a serious question now. Okay. Okay, wait, here. We got it. Yeah, buckle up. Oh, oh. oh boy. Yeah. All right. Are you guys ready? Mm-hmm. Yeah. F, Mary Kill, pancakes, waffles, and French toast. I'm gonna f French toast. Wow. All day what? long. All day what? long. French toast. Mm -hmm. Mary French toast. Wow. wow. I'm gonna f pancake and I'm gonna marry a, a French toast. Just one. You're only... Just one French toast. What, a pancake? And it's gonna be good. A pancake. Mary French toast. Yeah. Mary waffles. And you kill pancakes. You killed pancakes? Yeah, I know <laughs> a lot of people kill waffles because sometimes people make them like really crusty and they kind of mm. hurt the inside of my, my, my mouth sometimes. Okay. I love French toast. It's so good. Don't know if I want to have it all the time though. Yeah. But it's such a good time. So but I don't know make. if I want to be committed to it on so a daily. Good. Pancakes are the most bland, let's be real. <gasps> They're like, thank you. They're like thank you. soggy. Thank okay, you. you There's not a lot of options right. with pancakes. So you can't marry pancakes because it's just like, oh, your life is just going to be missionary. I marry pancakes. <laughs>
I married the pancakes. Have fun with no what do you mean? sex I, life for your breakfast. I, I, <laughs> Mary French toast. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, the pancake. Oh, pancake. Damn. We're talking breakfast foods, right? However you want it. You, you know what I mean? Eat it whenever breakfast, you want. lunch, right. dinner, then, 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 then pancakes. Then pancakes. You're marrying yeah. the pancakes? I'll marry the pancakes. Thank God. And See? waffles can kick it because waffles are they just Yeah, kill a waffle. Yeah. Hands down. That's easy. I mean they're right? good, but if between the three But are they? Yeah, they're good. They taste like they're fine. Um, they taste like pancakes with, 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 with creases in it. It's just <laughs> creases. Like green tea pancakes and, and ricotta with blueberries in it. Well, you're getting fancy now. Well, yeah, I'm fancy. <laughs> fancy pancakes. That's your option, though? You want ricotta in your pancakes? <laughs> every morning, every morning you wake up, Green you're married to that <sighs> pancake. Ricotta. Let me tell you something about waffles. Belgian, flat, crisp, mm -hmm. non-crisp. Eggo waffle. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to some Nutella <laughs> on that. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I married the pancakes. That's you married yeah, pancakes. We both God, married memory. pancakes. Okay. I you think okay? we both have having I sex. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not remembering much. <laughs> You guys haven't seen my pancakes. I fr like I crispy fry them in coconut oil. Like I'm out here. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Thank that's you. Different. They both killed pancakes. What? I like yeah. pancakes. Ew. They're amazing. Give us names. Thank you guys. Ari and Jeff. Okay. They're 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 uh, they're dumb. No. <laughs> Marry a waffle. What? A pancake that's and a waffle is happening. the same, except See, a waffle is is has difference. an impression on it. This is the difference in the generations. Yeah, yeah they like really waffles. Is. You guys are the bomb. Thank I just you. feel like you're gonna be everyone's new girlfriend. And you're gonna be everybody. <laughs> this was like so amazing having you guys. Thanks for having us. Literally, yeah. it's a dream. I literally made videos about this, and then here I am. Like Poof. this is be beautiful. Here we go. If you guys haven't seen the first episode, make sure you guys go watch it because we're already coming into the second episode. So after you guys watch this video, go and watch. Episode two and catch up. Make sure you see the new generation. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yay! Yay! If you guys have seen the first episode, put in the comments below. Let us know who your new favorite character is, who you feel like you most relate to, what was your favorite part, and I'll see you guys soon with the next video. I love you guys. Stay amazing, stay proud, stay woke. Peace.